Welcome back to A Creatively Crafted Life. It's Melanie again with day five. So yes, we are still skipping day three. <laughs> um, I just needed to put together a really quick layout and day three is going to take a little bit longer. So we'll get back to that one at some point. So the story for today is all about Christmas cards and how I love to make Christmas cards and I love to send Christmas cards. And I probably send out about 70 cards or I at least this year I sent out, sent out about 70 cards and the photos that I have are of me at addressing the or putting the cards in envelopes and addressing them and then samples or pictures of the different cards that I made um, I think this is probably most of them and obviously I would have made multiples in order to send out 70 and then I've got a large 6x8 photo with all the envelopes before I'm about to send them out, out. I typed up my journaling just because of the the space that is allotted and um, I wanted to be sure I could get the story in in the quite narrow space and I figured that was the easiest. As far as embellishing goes I think I'm just gonna put a little bit of a little star a little wood veneer star there. I'm gonna put the number five with the letters that I'm going to use for my title so we're just gonna add that at the bottom. My title I'm going to actually um, layer over top of the 6x8 and if maybe you can guess the title is going to be with every Christmas card I write. So it's quite large so it's going to take up a good chunk of it. I think there'll be enough contrast. I'm hoping. Um, I didn't have anything that had enough letters in order to make it work so we're going to try this. And then on the back of this three by eight page insert that I'm adding. There is a little space down here at the bottom. So I thought I could either use something like the special delivery sticker that will fit or um, tis the happiest season of all that might fit as well. And I'm not too concerned about the red not matching because if you look the cards are all different colors anyways. So um, you know I'm not going to make a big big deal about it. So either one of those I think will work or you know maybe when I get working on it I will use something else. Who knows? So I'm just gonna quickly assemble this, put it together and then I will be right back. So I didn't veer too much from my original plan. It's pretty much as I mapped out. So I have the two photos. I added a little bit of washi tape here on the bottom. Um, because of the way this photograph was there was a white strip at the end and it it bothered me that it was just white so we, the washi tape seemed to have helped that a little bit. Added the star, added the five, here's the little insert. I did add a tab, this was something I picked up from watching Ali Edwards and I used um, two different stamp sets so one says tidings we bring and the other one says happiness documented and it was right now which I think this was in I want to say an L Studio. I could be wrong on that one. And this one here is a Kelly Perky set, uh, which is good tidings we bring, but I, I masked out the good and just did the tidings we bring. And I stamped that with Poppy Parade Stampin' Up Ink. And that helps just to know that that has to flip over. I did add the special delivery at the bottom, and I also added some green washi tape from L Studio with the trees and then here's a six by eight page with every Christmas card I write and that is pretty much it for day five. <laughs> 